Hi, today's Tuesday tip is teaching yes and no with no technology at all. We start with technology and we slowly phase it out so that they have a yes and a no or some version of that without any technology at all. I usually use a talking button. I get these off of TLC inclusive. They used to sell them on Amazon. Lakeshore makes them. Um, you can use any single message button to do this. I'll record it with either a yes or a no. A lot of times I start with no and I'm placing the button to the side and reading a book like No David. And we're reading a book and he's really, really naughty. And instead of them hitting a single message button to say, turn the page, they're saying, no, David, no, David. Every time they hit the button, it says, no, no, no. Slowly, I move the button away and just put my hand. So they have a t stopping point and they don't have to do an extreme movement, but they learn to do just a subtle shake of the head means no. I've even taught this to blind children who have never seen anyone in their environment say no. They still now know how to shake no so that all those around them know what they mean. I do the same thing for yes up here. I usually don't do it down here because it causes kids to root or lick or drool. Although, and the other thing is sometimes they'll do this to hit the button. And I really don't want yes to mean an open mouth. So I'll put it at the top and they'll move up a little bit. My kids with very limited movement, eye gaze only, when they look up, I depress the button and it says yes. Eventually, when they look up, I depress their head and say yes, yes. Then they need no technology at all, no hands to their face, yes, no. It works like a charm. Good luck.